Now, here we go, Hutch. The moment that everyone's been waiting for, the main event of the evening. Pepper Parks taking on Cody Deer for that Crossfire Wrestling Heavyweight Championship. This is going to be awesome, Hutch. This is going to be off the hook. Pepper Parks, definitely a veteran of the ring, currently a TNA star. We've seen him at House of Hardcore, the husband of Cherry Bomb. Crossfire champion in trouble right off the bat. Fans are getting behind him, though. Now, as, as much as I was going off about how great Pepper Parks is, Cody Deaner's also an awesome individual as well. Fresh off his Global Force matches, current Crossfire Heavyweight Champion. This guy's been on a roll with that big win over Eric Young and Congo Kong. That is no small task. That is certainly no small task. Training, growing up with Eric Young. Eric Run taught oh. Cody Deaner a lot about the game of professional wrestling, and he's in there putting that smart to good use as the Crossfire Heavyweight Champion of the World. Well, Hutch, a lot of people may not know this, but Pepper Parks and Cody Deer do have a history with each other. These two have had many wars with each other, and it's so awesome to finally see it here at a Crossfire ring. Wow, the Parks. crowd calling for it, that DDT that Cody Deer likes to use to put his opponents away, and Pepper Park, well scouted. Uh, what's Pepper Park's moniker? By the body? By what do, what do I call him? Uh, he, he, he's anything you want to call him. So this guy is completely unoriginal. Calls himself the body like Jesse Ventura. Uses Rick Rude's one-liners to start his match. He's named after pretty much a household, a average everyday household condiment. This guy has nothing going on. Even his last name is the same as Abyss's last name. Why don't you get some originality, pal? Well, Pepper Park has been in the business for a long time. He lives in that gym. As you said before, he's the husband of Cherry Bomb, accomplished female wrestler. Oh, that's the biggest Ontario. accomplishment no. he's had in professional wrestling. Oh, hells no. This guy was just on the UK tour with Global Force. Pepper Parks is no slouch in the ring, and he's going to show everyone in Crossfire oh, why he is the number one contender right now. His wife's getting more attention with her feud with Courtney Rush than he's getting on uh, just about anything going on in his career. That's why he's got such a chip on his shoulder. Pepper Parks is always ready for a fight and he wants that Crossfire Wrestling Championship to add to his accolades. Wow, uh, this right here, Pepper Parks, he's not joking around. He truly believes he's stronger than everyone. He wants to prove it to Cody Deaner here. There we go, an old school test of strength right now. Come on, champ. Now. Let me show you what it's all about. Well, Pepper Parks does have the size advantage over Cody Deaner. Uh, I've been talking trash about him since the match started, but Pepper Parks is one heck of an athlete, knows what he's doing in there, and is certainly a threat to the Crossfire Heavyweight Champion, Cody Deaner. He sure is. If he hits that pepper shaker, it could be all done for Cody Deaner. Well, like you said, well known down at CZW Combat Zone Wrestling, and they don't pull their punches down there. That's a hardcore federation where this guy's been doing real good. Tag Team Champion, nothing wrong with that. Yeah, well, whether it's inside the ring, outside the ring, hardcore, straightforward catches, catch can. Pepper Pucks knows what he's doing, but the crowd energizing the champ who's getting to his feet and returns the favor here. Boots to the gut, back and forth with these guys. That's right, just back and forth, relentless, relentless with these kicks. Come on, why doesn't somebody just let go? You want to get out of this? There we oh. go, Cody Deaner getting the advantage here, and again. Again, scouted, showing the cowardice. That is brains right there. You do not want to get hit by that DDT. Oh, he almost got his brain scrambled is what happened. Uh, D Cody Deaner is the master of the DDT. That is just brilliant to get out of the way. It doesn't matter how it gets done as long as you do not get that DDT. Now, Pepper Park's talking with the fans. It's not too smart when you got Cody Deaner in the ring. Well, he's just regaining his composure, trying to bring the match down to his pace and kind of let some of that momentum bleed off of Cody Deaner. Like hey. ice on a comet, bit by bit, just bleeding off until he cools right down again. And it's once again an even contest here. Well, it's smart. Well, you don't want to get counted out in the world title match. Does Cody Deaner have like, like a picture of himself on his tights where his face is a skull? Yeah, look at that. That's pretty cool. I, yeah, I'm, I think that's one of Cody Deaner's t-shirts that he saw at the merchandise table. That's cool. So I don't usually get anybody's t-shirts. I did buy one of Rhino's t-shirts running for office down in his home state of Michigan in the States. Vote for Rhino. I got one of those shirts. I think the first shirt I've ever bought at a Crossfire show.
Well, right out those bruised ribs, he's definitely gonna need help pay for those medical bills. <laughs> oh, broken ribs. Yes, yeah. that's right, sorry, broken ribs. If you haven't seen that, folks, check out the Crossfire Wrestling YouTube page right here where you're at. You can see Congo Kong against Rhino and the fallout from that match, the man beast Rhino in some serious pain from broken ribs. And the same thing happened to our tag team champion here tonight, Hellcat. So some serious damage, some fists are flying, and no difference here in our championship match. That's right, Dina relentless with those stomps. See, every match tonight has been a fight. No one wants to lose. Everyone's out there to hurt their opponents because they want to win. Well, the last two matches have had broken ribs, a pair of them. Oh. So if uh, if things if stay the course here, one of these two men is going to be taken out of here in an ambulance, just like Rhino and just like Hellcat. No one wants to see it, but that is the one unfortunate thing about this business, Hutch. The action is hard, the action is fast, and, and people do get hurt. Again, going for the DDT. Wow, and if Cody Deaner hits that, we're gonna be seeing him in May at Mayhem defending the Crossfire Heavyweight Championship. Already at Mayhem, we got a four-way tag team title match. That's gonna be awesome. That's going to be off the hook. And whoever the champion is here after this match, they gotta watch out for a guy like Kong Kong. That win after, after defeating Rhino, he's gotta be right up there in the number one contender. Could definitely be, oh, number one contender. And Cody Dina just spit water at Pepper Parks. Pepper Parks out into the audience, can't see. Looks like he's grabbing something from the crowd. Well, May 29th could very well be Pepper Parks defending the Crossfire Championship. Oh, Dina spits another mouthful of water right at Pepper Parks. We'd probably end up seeing a rematch Those between these two guys. The railing right there. Pepper Parks did, this isn't good. Not good, Pepper Parks falling over the railing. Say his name again? Pepper Parks. Again? Pepper Parks. Yeah, I'm trying to take him seriously. I really am here, Chris. You have to. You have oh, to, the way this wow. man trains, the way this man fights, you have to take him serious. They're just going to work on Pepper Parks and the fans right now. Wow, jeez, man, the fans might as well be Cody Dieter's manager. They have been as involved in this match as the two competitors. Well, the fans are behind the Crossfire champion. I will give them that. And Cody Dieter, a funny guy, I don't know what he said, but the whole audience reacted, probably making fun of Pepper Parks' name. Well, Pepper Park's now getting thrown back into the ring. The referee's finally getting control of this thing, put, bringing it right back into the ring here. Oh! Nice knee by Pepper Parks. Right to the hip. That's gotta hurt. And look. Ow, back of the head. Pepper Parks tying up the crossfire champ in the ropes here. Come on, ref. Oh. That's more than a five count. Yeah, get him off of him. Oh, oh wow! wow. Big kick. running boot to the face, Yakuza kick style, and the champ is out to the outside. Look at that, flex into the crowd. The fans are behind Pepper Parks now. Cody Dieter's on the outside, he looks hurt. Here we go, here's another look at that boot. Wham, right to the mush. Now the champ is still out. Now this is smart for Pepper Parks to go on the outside of the ring and, and hit Cody Dieter because you can't win the title with the champion outside of the ring. Now, I know, like I said, I've been making fun of him, but this guy's a vet. Look at the vascular conditioning of Pepper Park. Look at the veins popping out. Look at the chest. He isn't yeah. joking. When he uh, when he's talking about being the sexiest man in the world, sure, he's got an ego. Sure, he looks in the mirror a little too often, but I tell you, it's not. He's not far off with those statements. This guy looks fabulous. Sex weights and protein shakes. That's how he lives his life. Sex huh? weights and protein shakes. And right now he's just going to work for the Crossfire Heavyweight Champion. Oh wow, just driving the knee into the back of the head. Pepper Parks now in full control of this match. He has the champion exactly where he wants him right now. The champion reeling here, Pepper Parks in firm control. And Cody Deaner, wow. I don't think he knows where he's at. Yeah, there we go. He has no idea what's going on. And Pepper Parks taking a full advantage. He sees an opening, he's like a shark in the water. Once he sees blood, he attacks. Except in this case, Pepper Parks found an opening and he just taking the it. heel right into the jugular. That was one of the most vicious Puts on the throat I've ever seen. Is he biting him now? I can't tell from here. Come on. 
Well, Pepper Parks, he does not like Cody Deaner. He has stated that before. They have a history together, and he cannot, and he could not wait to get his hands on Cody Deaner. He jumped at the chance to not only fight Deaner, but an opportunity to embarrass him, take away the Crossfire title. He couldn't wait to get in that ring. Of course, he does not like Cody Deaner. If I was outside with you when Pepper Parks pulled up in his car, he was here two or three hours early getting ready. He wants to embarrass Cody Deaner. They hate each other, and he's showing it here in the ring today, oh, wearing yes. down the champ. Pepper Parks is focused. Cody Deaner using the crowd support to get, trying to get out right now. Oh, oh. come on, ref. A little bit of Yano Toro there from New Japan, just ripping Cody Deaner down to the canvas. That was a hard impact. Taking a little too much time, in my opinion, but still connecting with Cody Deaner. Pepper Parks seems to really have the pulse of this match. And he's been in firm control over the champ for a majority, Chris. Yes, Pepper Parks is here for a fight. Uh, and this again. is exactly where Cody, or Pepper Parks wants Cody Deaner. I keep expecting Cody to move, Pepper taking too much time. But like I said, he's really got the pulse of this match, the pace of it, exactly the way he wants. Like, he, like you said, he's fought Cody Deaner many times, so he knows how to read him all. Hard and he's reading line. him like a book here. You're right, Hutch. Here we go. Wow, this oh. time. Oh! Cody Deer springs up. It looks like Pepper with... lost that tooth. Cody Deer springs up with that clothesline. What impact there by Cody Deer. Pure desperation. Let's take another quick look here. Here we go. Look at the impact and wham. Looks like Pepper Parks lost that tooth and both men down. Back to live action, six count, and neither man has moved an inch. No, this is not good. I do not want to see a double count out. I want to see a clear cut winner in this match. The two okay. competitors like this. Both men getting to their knees. And Pepper Parks, the first one with a flat foot on the ground, breaking the count. And here we go from their knees. These two are going to exchange shots. Close fist blows, and the ref is letting it all hang out here. We're going to see a champion. No DQ, no count out. This is for the Crossfire Heavyweight Championship. We're going to have a winner here. Well, this is what everyone came to see, Hutch. Oh. Oh, wow. Listen to the flesh on flesh. Oh. Wow. Finally opening up those hands a bit to some legal blows, but they still sting. What an exchange by these two, just back and forth oh, with those rights. Oh, big forearm there from Pepper. Getting more and more vicious. And now Dina with a close fist. They're getting serious here. Bam, oh. another one. And a third oh. one. Bam, a fourth one. Jabbing it up here. And the champ is on fire, Chris. He sure is, Hutch. He's all over Pepper Parks right now. And the fans are loving it. Wow. Oh. Oh. A big discus clothesline. That uh, took out Rhino earlier. That was beautiful. And Cody Deaner feeling it here, singling for the DDT. He could have Pepper Parks right where he wants him. Deaner's taking a lot of damage. He better put away Pepper Parks soon, or this momentum might wane. They're off for yes. the third or fourth time. Brilliant. The fans are behind Deaner. They're stealing the DDT, but Pepper Parks said he would have none of that. That just proves you right there how devastating a move it is. Cody Deaner has it down pat. Oh, has his, oh, no. oh, 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 flying red neck. Wow. Cody Deaner, that suicide dive right out of Pepper Parks. And damn right these fans should be chanting this is Let's awesome. Let's get another look here. Slow-mo, tope, suicida through the second rope and wham right into Pepper Parks. That crossfire champ has the crowd firmly in his corner. Back to live right, back, action here. I can barely speak, and Cody Deaner climbing the ropes here. What's going to happen? Now, it's not good, because Cody Deaner's not known for his aerial skills, Hutch. Well, looks like he might be digging in the elbow. We've seen that before. Well, that's the only thing I've ever seen Deaner do. The A headbutt. big flying headbutt. Wow. Oh, Pepper oh, Parks barely gets that shoulder up. All instinct there. Cody Deaner wow. adding new pages to the book that is his offensive resume here at Crossfire today, and impressively so. Fans are calling for it. 
That's right, fans, call it forward, and I could finally be the time we see the DDT from Cody Deaner, the Dirty DDT. Oh, Pepper Parks is getting up. Be a Death Valley driver. No, Deaner's fighting out. Oh, Pepper Parks slingshot. Into wow, the corner. right into the corner. And folks, those turnbuckles are not as soft as they appear. That hurts. Pepper oh, Shaker! Pepper Shaker wow. in the ring! Did you see the torque on that? Shoot! Two, three, oh. 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 oh! oh, I thought we had a new champ oh, here. I thought we had a new champ too, and so did Pepper Parks. Look, he's mad! Oh, I'd be too. The Pepper Shaker, not many people have ever kicked out of that move. Well, here we go, another look at it, Chris. And look at the torque. Wham! Jeez! Wow. Excuse me! Wow! Talking Back to live action here. That was impressive that Cody Deaner kicked out of that one, Chris. Talking about shaking and not stirred. I cannot believe that. Cody Deaner with well, now, the resiliency of a champion to get his shoulder up. But now Pepper Park's going somewhere we're not used to seeing him. Go. Oh, uh, this is good rollout. Uh, Pepper Park's also attempting to add new books to his book of oh. offensive maneuvers, but it's not working out as well as he did for the champ. Oh, here we go. A oh, oh. big knee. Not a good landing for Pepper Park. Wow, and there it is. There's the broken rib we were waiting for. Every match here has been going. It's been absolutely brutal at Crossfire. They've all, oh! Oh, oh a sit down power bump. Oh! Almost. Wow. Wow. <laughs> wow. What fortitude to get that shoulder up by Pepper Parks. What a main event here today, Chris. Exactly. Now the fourth, this is awesome chant during this match. This is what people paid to see, Hutch. This is indeed awesome. This is the first time you're ever going to hear me say I'm actually honored to be calling this match. Well, I have been honored to call many a contest here at Crossfire, but this one certainly ranks up there. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Oh, oh Cody saw it happening. Pepper Parks, that would have been a DQ in my opinion. Oh, oh no! And not the same courtesy that time. The referee is down. Well, that was obviously an accident. Pepper Parks pulled the referee in on purpose, and we've got a pinball here from the champ. Wait a minute. And there's no ref. Let's get another ref out here. Deaner had it right there. But that was smart of Pepper Parks not to use any energy to kick out there because he knew there was no referee around to make that oh, count. Let's get Brady out here. Somebody, anybody out here, man. Pepper Parks with a low blow. Cody Deaner is down. I don't know, I'm speechless here. And Pepper Parks again to the outside. Oh, what's going Pepper on Parks here? Pepper the man. The title. the title. I don't know, I don't have the title. It's over, over there. there. Pepper Parks looking for that title. Well, I don't know why, though. What's he going to do? He's going to use it? Well, the referee's hey, out. No referee. Oh, no, he's going to use the title belt as a, as a weapon. Once why again, not? another unoriginal move from Pepper Parks here. And why not? The referee's not around. Heck, go for it. This is your opening. Take it. This guy is the king of unoriginal. Very soon you're going to be calling him Crossfire Champion, Hutch. Oh, no! Hard belt shot. Get that out of the way. Get it. Come on, get the ref. Come on. A hard fuck contest like this cannot end this way. I don't exactly sure like can. Pepper Parks, but he Dude. had every opportunity to be. Oh! Oh! Tony oh. Peter! Listen, this crowd, get behind him. You got the shoulder up in that last split oh, stuck oh. in Hutch. I am basically speechless here. Cody Dean has shown us exactly how tough he is. You're right, Hutch. We have had a lot of toughness on display here tonight. Rhino, Hellcat, working half a match here with a broken rib and still coming out with his title. And now Cody Dieter kicking out after a shot to the head from the heavyweight championship. And Pepper Parks is setting him up again here. That just shows you how important it is to move up in the rankings and to become champion here at Crossfire. But I mean, Pepper Parks has all the tools to beat Cody Dieter legally. He doesn't need to do this. How can he be proud of himself? As long as you walk out as champion, it doesn't matter how it gets done in the record books, they'll still say, oh! oh! Here we go, go, Cody Deaner! Oh, oh yes, the Dirty Deaner DDT! We've seen it before! One, two, and Listen to this crowd of rough. Cody Deaner is still your Crossfire Wrestling Heavyweight Champion. What a match!
Well, what's this? The Champs music stuck. What's this? This is a Kong of Kong song, Hutch. I was going to say that the Champs music just stopped and... Oh, man, does that mean more Jay Moore? Give me a break. Ah, oh, more Jay Moore. And there, Cody Dina showing the kind of guy he is, showing the kind of moxie he's got. Oh, from behind, Pepper Parks. Wow, Pepper Parks has two tag team championships to his name right now, so he's no stranger of teaming up with people. Here comes Rhino, broken ribs and all. No, nah, Pepper putting an end to this. No, nah, Rhino. Uh, Rhino's got those bruised ribs from earlier, and Pepper Park, he knows it. He's going right after him. Look at that. Rhino is trying to suck it up. And Pepper Park's going right after the weak spot on that WWE legend. But here to help out the Crossfire Heavyweight Champion. That's a man. That's a man with a pair, let me tell you. That's a real man with a real pair. Let's get the champs music on. That's what I'm talking about. Cody Deaner, victorious here today at Crossfire Wrestling. You can join us May 29th right here at the Marion Community Center. We'll see you next time here at Crossfire Wrestling.